do subscribe to the channel union minister of state for finance shri bhagwat kisam rao karad announced that indian banks have received 5729 crore rupees from the depositor education and awareness d fund to facilitate the refund of unclaimed deposits in the last 5 years phone pay a digital payments platform has partnered with paymate a leading digital business to business b2b payments and service provider to allow users to pay their income tax on the phone pay app called income tax payment hdfc asset management company hdfc amc investment manager to hdfc mutual fund hdfc mf has launched the hdfc charity fund for cancer cure in partnership with the indian cancer society ics twitter owner elon musk has launched a new logo the single letter x to replace the social media services famous bluebird as part of a broader rebranding effort in a significant move prime minister shri narendra modi announced the launch of unified payment system upi in france the fourth environment and climate sustainability working group ecswg an environment and climate ministers meeting began in chennai Shri Jyotiraditya M Sinha Minister for Civil Aviation and Steel inaugurated three flight training organizations FTO in Khajuraho Madhya Pradesh Ministry of Textiles under its flagship scheme National Technical Textiles Mission NTTM organized the 6th National Conclave on Standards and Regulations in association with FICCI and BIS emphasizing the importance of standards quality regulations and rationalization of HSN codes for technical textiles in India The Ministry of Chemicals and Fertilizer in association with the Federation of Indian Chambers of Commerce and Industry FICCI is organizing the third edition of the summit on Global Chemicals and Petrochemicals Manufacturing Hubs in India GCPMH 2023 in New Delhi Chhattisgarh based Coal India subsidiary South Eastern Coal Fields SECL will invest Rs 169 crores on a plantation in its operating states of Chhattisgarh and Madhya Pradesh during the next 5 years. Union Home Minister and Minister of Cooperation Shri Amit Shah will launch a unique initiative Mera Gaon Meri Dharua as part of Azadi Ka Amrit Mahotsav. In May 2023, the National Coal Index NCI dropped significantly by 33.8%, reaching 157.7 points. The union government has emphasized that ethical conduct is a key factor in the fair administration of the sporting disciplines and facilitates a safe environment free of harassment and discrimination for all stakeholders participating in sports. India secured the second position on the medals tally at the ISSF Junior Shooting World Championships 2023 held in Changwon, South Korea. City-based cost and management accountant CMA Neeraj Joshi has been elected as the Central Council member CCM of the Institute of Cost Accountants of India ICMAI and CMA Chetanya Mohari elected as the Western India Regional Council member RCM Pan Gongsheng was named China's central bank governor in the widely anticipated final major appointment of the ruling Communist Party's once a decade change of power The president of India Draupadi Murmu appointed Justice Devendra Kumar Upadhyaya from the Allahabad High Court HC as the chief justice of the Bombay High Court In a historic move, Chairman Rajya Sabha Shri Jagdeep Dhankar has nominated four women parliamentarians, namely P.T. Usha, S. Pangnam Konyak, Dr. Fauzia Khan, and Sulata Deo, to the panel of vice chairpersons. Based on the recommendation of the Nomination and Remuneration Committee, Tata Steel has reappointed T.V. Narendran as Managing Director (MD) and Chief Executive Officer (CEO) for a further period of five years, effective September 19, 2023, through September 18, 2028. Remembering the supreme sacrifices by the Indian soldiers, the Commune of Monotone in Italy and Italian military historians have unveiled C. Ishwan Bhagge Sandal Memorial. At Montfon, Perugia, Italy, as a tribute to the Indian troops who fought during Italian campaign during the Second World War, and to honor Nayak Yeshwan Ghatge, Victoria Cross, who was killed in action fighting on the heights of Upper Tiber Valley. The Space Exploration Technologies Corporation, commonly referred to as SpaceX, launched 22 Starlink V2 mini satellites into low Earth orbit (LEO) from Space Launch Complex 40 at the Cape Canaveral Space Force Station in Florida, the United States of America (USA). One of the most famous computer hackers in the history of cybersecurity, Kevin Mitnick, passed away at the age of 59.